let me tell you something manifesting becomes so easy once you realize you're already always manifesting you probably just haven't realized it you need to start becoming more aware of what's going on in your mind and how it's re being reflected back at you through your external world because that's what this is thoughts become real things that we perceive because the brain is in control of all of this basically we are perceiving the world through the senses through our brain and when we can harness this power to manipulate our outside external world we're able to gain true freedom i'm not really here to convince you whether this is real or not but i just wanted to share a couple stories of mine on how i've manifested recently like very recently ever since i became aware that i'm always manifesting and i just need to change my perspective in order to manifest the things that i want so first of all, I don't follow a ritual of manifestation. Like all these people on YouTube have videos talking about this is the technique you should use to manifest something. I don't do that. Like we're already always doing it and it's just by what we're thinking of constantly and subconsciously. You know, when you first get a new car, you start seeing other people driving that car so much more than you ever had before. It's because you're changing your perspective and you can do that with other things. So anyway, I've been thinking a lot recently about how I want my life to look in the future and how I can do things now to reflect that. And I understand I'm in a very privileged place where I get to stay home and just take care of my son all day and I have time to work on all these things. Um, so I understand that not everyone has that ability. But anyway, I sat down and wrote out all these things, how my life is gonna look. For example, one of those things was to take morning walks every day um, with my son. And I was like, I can start doing that now, especially since the weather is getting warmer. You know, actually the first day that I started doing this, it was raining and I was like, I can't wait around and keep making excuses. If I want the life that I envision for myself, I gotta start doing these things now. I feel like once I started doing that and getting in this mind space of I already am living the life I've dreamed of, then it was like anything else I started thinking of that aligned with what I was envisioning started to happen for me. For example, um, it was just a p passing thought. I didn't even write this down or anything. I was thinking, it would be nice to for my boyfriend and I to schedule massages like we give each other massages because in the future maybe we'll have a regular routine of going to a spa and getting massages so let's start doing this for each other now um, to prepare ourselves I guess for the future but literally I thought about this for one day I didn't even talk to him about it because I kind of forgot but like three days later, I got a text from his sister saying that she got me an early Mother's Day gift and it was a trip to the spa for a massage. So that was like one of those things I was like, oh snap, I literally manifested that in just a few days. Another thing is I have been playing with fashion a lot recently because I was so against everything I had in my closet. I felt like I had nothing to wear all the time. So I was always in sweats. Um, if you've seen my vlogs, that like hoodie robe thing. And like, I just felt kind of yuck. So I decided to go thrifting, bought a few pieces I knew I could pair with other things. And then ever since then, I've been trying to play around with fashion in a creative outlet sort of way. I was thinking, man, I would really love to play around with jewelry more. I don't have that many pieces or as many pieces as I would like. For example, necklaces, I don't have many bracelets or rings. I have a lot of earrings, but nothing else. And I was like, it would be really cool to get some of those things and just have them in the rotation and mixing and matching even more things and accessories. And then again, just a few days after thinking this thought, um, I was over at my boyfriend's mom's house and she is someone who goes thrifting and antiquing a lot and collects so many cool things she all of a sudden brought up that I could go through her necklaces and she brought down all these pearl necklaces, all these different types of chains and things. And then she just let me go through all of her collection basically of necklaces, bracelets, um, and earrings. So I thanked her so much for that. I was so excited. I felt like a kid in a candy store. But yeah, now I have a nice collection and I've been putting together these fun outfits every day and just been really enjoying myself. And that kind of reflects 
the future I saw for myself, um, always like being well dressed um, and also being able to dress in a creative way. Plus just getting dressed every day instead of wearing your loungewear um, actually boosts your confidence and your productivity. So I got to benefit from that as well. And this is the third kind of manifestation that it's more like um, a serendipitous type thing. But I've been thinking about a lot about um, how I feel like I need to be living by my younger sister. And then I was also thinking my parents as well. So getting out of the area we live in right now and going closer to her or just finding a new place altogether and all of us coming together and living in the same general area. And then I was just at my parents' house yesterday and my mom just brought it up as well. And she also mentioned the same area that I had actually been thinking of being the best spot for us to go to. So it was just kind of interesting and feeling like I'm on the right path. You know, it's like the universe or God or whatever you believe in is sprinkling in all these little bits of confirmation that I'm on the right path. So it feels really great. And I just want you to know that once you become aware of the things you're already manifesting, for example, if you start off your day by stubbing your toe and then the next thing you spill your coffee and then the next thing you're stuck in traffic and are late to work and it just goes on and on and the day gets worse and worse it's because you're thinking so much about and giving too much power to that first thing that kind of set it off when you can stop it at any time by just changing your mindset to something more positive start thinking about the things you're grateful for and feeling that gratitude and um, just being present in that and that's how you can really quickly see a difference in your day and in the things that you're manifesting so yeah that was just a quick little video about that i hope you enjoyed if you did you could like and also subscribe and make sure your bell notifications are on because i post weekly and i sometimes do the community tab as well but yeah thanks again so much for watching i'll see you in the next one